Gaffy, you asked for a response and a performance, and I think we got both of those tonight, didn't we? No, definitely. I thought we were um, terrific tonight um, from, from start to finish. Um, the performance of everyone that, that came on for us tonight, I thought, was, was excellent. It was committed, it was together, it was hard working, it, it, it was disciplined in its shape, understood, understood the roles that the lads were supposed to do, and he executed really, really well. And I'm very, very proud of him tonight. In your pre-match with me, you said you uh, wanted to see some pride, courage and character from your side. How good were we tonight and how much did we show that? I think we showed all of it and I think for all of us is the, and, and, and me and the players and I know you know supporters get frustrated, but we're the same, that we, we know what we've got in the changing room and sometimes you've got to just strip it back and go back to basics and you know, roll your sleeves up and walk hard on the path like everyone does tonight. And uh, on all the system this season has been the three defenders with the wing backs, but tonight you defied a 4 3 3. What was your thinking behind that going into the game? We just knew they were very good in possession and we felt they played 4 2 3 1 and we felt that we could get to and rest the into the spaces and put their full backs and make them forward. It was important that we played good passes in behind their full backs and I thought we did that for a couple of our goals. We counted really well and I think we should have made it 4 0 as well at the start of the second half with a great bit of play from West Ham to Macrath Robber and it really is game over. And uh, on live commentary of this fixture, I heard a large amount of praise for Manny Onorisa and Harry Phipps. Just how good were they tonight? I thought they were brilliant. I thought Manny was, you know, was treading a little bit in the first half and he got that yellow card, he had to be careful. Um, but I thought the second half he showed a really, really mature, calm performance. I thought Phipps, he was outstanding. Um, I've always said how much I love Harry Phipps. I've re-signed him three times. He's hardly ever played for me because of his injuries. But he's a kid that I really want to do well. Um, and I thought tonight he was awesome. And uh, Paul McCallum was back amongst the goals tonight with a brace. How good is it to see him hitting the back of the net again? Yeah, I thought, forget the goals for a minute, I thought he's walk ethic leading the line, being a platform for us to play into first and foremost to give us all that. And when you tend to put performance like that in, the goals come after, come after that. I think sometimes you can put the car before the horse, you've got to go and do the walk first and then the rest comes. I thought McCallum done that tonight really well. And uh, just going into half time, obviously we were three goals to be good. What did you say to the lads at the break? keep going and keep doing the same things. The performance levels were really good and we knew we'd, we'd hit them in the break. And, um, I think we did two or three times in the first five or ten minutes in our second half. It's a point that we couldn't, we couldn't make it forward end. I think then it would have killed the game. Um, they got, obviously they got that goal back and then in, in, in the game I don't think Elliot had a lot to do to be honest. It's a point with the second goal because I felt the lad was unmarked in, in the middle of a goal but I've got to be honest as well, we've got lads on them empty. Josh Hare's been injured, Lincoln's been back, injured, back into the team. Fipsy's not been in the team. Um, Junior's not been in the team, so we had a lot, a lot of cramp in the group. Um, so I can forgive them that last goal in the, in the last couple of minutes. And uh, another huge game of the weekend, live on BT Sport against Southend United. How important is it for us to carry on our, uh, with our momentum? Yeah, I just think it's performance again. Just, just focus on the performance and, and, and the rest follows. It's important now that we just rest up. We know we've got an early kickoff as well. Eat your food on the way home tonight, rest up tomorrow, and then we go again to get ready for Saturday.